Hello, it's Amanda Ramsey. I'm a professional makeup artist and I've been working as a professional artist for the last 14 years. I'm also in my 40s and I'm a busy mother of two wild boys. This is a bit of a trend that is not going anywhere. It's not seeing any signs of changing anytime soon. It's a bit of a no makeup no makeup look and it's all about fresh skin and very lightly flushed cheeks. So it's a really simple look. And I'm going to use to start with this Jane Iredale. It's called Smooth Affair. Primer's great for those of you with oily skin, really oily skin. Mmm, smells delicious. <laughs> so I'm going to choose this product which is called Dream Tint. It's a tinted moisturiser from Jane Iredale. So we're just going to give the illusion of more youthful looking skin. Wow, it's really moisturising. It smells lovely too. Okay, and make sure you come all the way down your neck. Given it's got the SPF 15, I'd also be tempted, just going to move, to bring it down here on your decolletage as well. Why not? Just going to even that out a little bit and give you a bit of sun protection. Look, my skin just looks fresh and healthy. Jane Iredale, oh my goodness, I'm having a terrible time <laughs> reading it. Jane Iredale Eye Sheer, whoop, Eye Sheer. So it's a liquid, this colour is Champagne Silk and it's a liquid shadow. And I'm just going to paint that straight onto my lid. It's lovely and sheer, but it knocks back any redness and that sort of veiny, crepey look that you might have on your lids. We all have it. A little bit of this shadow here. Hopefully you can see just this colour here. So I've just put a light wash of colour all over the lid and I'm going to keep it really simple. That's all I'm going to do for our no makeup makeup look. I am going to curl my lashes. Next I'm actually going to put on my mascara. Um, black. Go for black. Black suits everyone. But come back and put sort of two to three and really focus it on the outer corners of your lashes. That will again just really hope to lift, help to lift and open your eyes. And we want lift because that's what makes us look a little more awake, much younger. So don't get carried away with concealer. You just want to cover anywhere that you feel is a little bit, got a little bit of extra redness, or you might have a little spot like this little friend I've got down here. So just using your finger or a little tiny brush, just take a little bit of concealer and just place it over the spot. Gently, the warmth of your finger will, will help melt the concealer into your skin so we keep that really fresh bare face look going. So remember you're really trying to keep your skin looking like skin so be use sparingly. So if you're feeling a little bit baggy in the eye area like I am today, just dot the concealer ever so gently in the baggy bit. So in the crevice of the baggy bit. Because 
Concealer and wrinkles are not friends. Concealer will not cover up wrinkles. It will just actually make them look far worse. So that's why I like to just do this little trick. Then take your finger. So you're really just covering up that darkness without concealing the whole under eye area. Cool, so that's it for concealing. Keep it really simple. Don't try and cover your whole face because you're beautiful. Next I'm going to use this brow product. It's called Pure Brow Brow Gel. I love a brow gel. This is a great way just to plump up your brows super fast. So it's a bit like a mascara and you just want to comb, brush it through the hairs of your brow and this will just plump them up. Sounds strange plumping up an eyebrow, I know, but it will just give it a little bit of dimension. Brows are a really, they're a really important feature, particularly in us over 40s women, uh, because they do tend to fade, either go gray or they just fade as we get older. So adding a bit of color, defining them, even if it is just with a little bit of brown mascara, will instantly make your face look more alive and younger. And that's what we all want, don't we? <laughs> Who doesn't want to look a little bit younger? So really gently first, you know, until you get used to using this product. makes quite a big difference, subtle but significant, um, in lifting this side of my face. This, this brow looks more lifted than the other side, so give it a go, just give it a try. Um, it's a lot faster as well than using a pencil. I'm going to use this product, it's called Moon Glow. And you can see it's got a whole range of colors through here. So I'm actually just going to choose this lighter section just to highlight the tops of my cheekbones and maybe a little bit on the cupid's bow. And also because I've got this stunning, if you can see, dress, off the shoulder dress. So I'm just going to highlight my collarbones using these paler colors. This is great because you can use this as an eyeshadow palette as well. Fluffy brush. Okay, and a little bit on the collarbones. There, look at that. Ooh, how good is that? So, hello spring. We have sprung here. With just a little bit of moon glow. I'm going to use this product. It's called, oh my goodness, my eyesight. <laughs> a bit of a symptom of being 45, I think, is called Forever Pink. And this is lush because it's super hydrating. What do you think? Thank you for watching my simple no makeup makeup look for spring party season. Uh, keep it really fresh and simple, little bit of flush on the cheek, a little bit of glowiness. Um, it's a really quick, simple look to complement your party outfit. Now, if you'd like to know more, especially for women over the age of 40, head to my website, which is amandaramsey.com.au. It's the best zone for tips, tricks, my insider secrets as a professional artisan, also an over 40 woman for makeup and beauty. So I hope to see some of you uh, join me over there on my amazing tribe of chicks over 40. So I look forward to seeing you all soon. Bye from me.